Today I will show you how to keep focused when it comes to training for your personal fitness and training goals from taking part on the Conqueror Virtual Challenge Series. My name is James King and I compete in obstacle course races and mud runs in my spare time and running has become a big part of my training plan. In this video we're going to look at the Virtual Conquerors English Channel Challenge. It's a 21 mile challenge and it's great for beginners or anybody that's looking to get into fitness. So stay tuned and I'll be sharing five benefits of doing a virtual challenge. By taking on the Conqueror's Virtual Fitness Challenge, you will work towards achieving a goal towards one of these beautifully crafted medals. All you have to do is sign up, lock your distance via the Virtual Missions app or website every time you complete a distance-based exercise. Although we're looking at the English Channel Virtual Challenge, what's great about this challenge is you don't have to just do swimming, you can do running jogging, cycling, hiking or any trackable distance based activity. If you use a fitness app such as the Apple Watch, Apple Health, Strava, Under Armour or Fitbit you can sync the data directly from your fitness app into the virtual missions app so then you don't have to worry about logging those miles but alternatively you can log in manually as well. So let's look at the five benefits of taking the time to look at this virtual challenge and see how it can benefit you. But this challenge is a 21 mile challenge, 33.8 kilometers, and it's achievable for anyone. With the Conqueror's events, you choose the deadline. It is so easy to fit in your schedule. The beauty of this race is you can mix it up with any exercise you want if it's running, hiking, swimming, etc. to do that. But there's only so many hours in the day for people and you have 78 weeks to complete this challenge. And there are other events that they do as well. This is the shortest one at 21 miles. So this is easily attainable to do and get and achieve. So it's worth looking at. And on the side it says virtually anything is possible. And with that time frame, there's absolutely no way you can't fail unless you don't do the work. But this is a great way to get started. Now, the second benefit of signing up for these virtual medals, it's a great motivator to reach your goal. Initially, I did the Hadrian's Wall challenge, which was 90 miles as the first one. But for the second one, I wanted to challenge myself at swimming and get better. Now, as a kid, I wasn't fond of swimming and being underwater. I wasn't keen on the water. So initially, I started this challenge before the COVID-19 scenario and focused on swimming. So I completed a good seven or eight miles with swimming. And I was using my Fitbit to go down the pool and shave off times. I was trying to get from 45 seconds to 32 seconds. And it was a great feeling and sense of achievement of doing that. But also it was great to say I've logged 600 to 700 metres with swimming because I find swimming difficult. I'm used to running and cycling. So it's a great way of motivating yourself for anything you want to train for. And it gives you a great sense of pride and achievement as well. Now, everybody's goal is different than other people's, but it's essential that you run your own race. And when it comes to training, these virtual challenges help you stay committed to the goal. So whatever your goal is, you can achieve it. And having something like this, that's a tangible, means that you're more likely to succeed. Now, the third benefit of these virtual medals is they're tangible. Once you've received or reached the finish line, it's great to get that sense of accomplishment as well. But these medals are beautifully crafted. They're robust, they're beautiful. I must admit, when I look in my collection of medals, 20, 30 odd, I find that these Conqueror's medals stand out. These are amazing. You will not be disappointed with the quality. Sometimes you can do races and events and you find the medals are not that great. These are amazing. You will not be disappointed. And when you see how much effort you've put into working towards these medals, I can assure you, you'll take a lot of pride in these. Some people after doing certain events like the London Marathon will wear these medals for weeks because it's a big challenge. Now these are beautiful. 
When it comes to doing the virtual challenges, you can do them with your friends, do them alone, but you're going to be part of a big community. There's lots of people doing these around the world, these challenges. And when you log into the app on the website, you will see a Google map and you'll see where other people are progressing on the route as well. And for some people, the English challenge might be a bucket list challenge. Now, this is a virtual race and it gives you that sense of achievement that you can do this. So if you were looking at doing something that was bigger for an event like this, this will give you a catalyst to keep you focused. It doesn't matter what you're training for. It could be for a swimming event or if you want to keep your kids involved in swimming classes. This can be a great way of keeping that momentum going. Final benefit in this video I'd like to cover it is every time you work towards that milestone, you get a bit stronger. That could be physically or mentally as well, but you're also building character. So when you are training for an event or a competition or just a way to stay fit, these challenges are going to give you opportunities to grow and step outside your comfort zone. And that shapes you as a better person. It makes you stronger. It makes you more resilient. And it also says that when you train for things that are beyond your comfort zone, you can handle things in other aspects of life. So I find these are a great way to build character and develop mental and physical strength. So every time you work towards one of these events, you're doing a workout, you're getting fitter, you're moving towards your goal. And at the end of the day, you will receive one of these amazing medals. So there is, these are well worth looking at doing. And I'm not just saying that because I'm an affiliate. I do these to help me train for 12 hour obstacle course races or in the winter or any time that I feel that I'm not going to be motivated. You'll be surprised how many people are motivated by something that's tangible. And the character building is something you can't buy. You get it from doing the hard work. Now, I do use these medals to help me in my training, but I believe in the product and these are incredible. They've kept me on the, the path that I want to be on for almost a year now. And throughout my training, it's great to lock the distances and work towards something. I'm working on my fourth medal now. And for anybody that's actually serious about staying in a consistent basis of training and they find it can get easily distracted, this could be the answer. Now, I am an affiliate, but I do believe in the products and it's helped me along my journey. So if you are interested, have a look at the link below in the description. It is well worth having a look. I hope this has been some benefit and value to yourselves. I mean, this is the journey I've gone on and I'm more than happy to share others. I've got some other medals that I'm working towards at the moment and I will be doing more videos when I have the time. But thank you for watching. I wish you well with your training and fitness goals. And I hope to see you in additional videos. Take care.